The Constitutional Court has ruled that former President Jacob Zuma is not eligible to stand for office in the National Assembly. This ruling comes just a day after Zuma led the Umkhonto Wesizwe Party's official election manifesto launch. Judge Theron declared that Jacob Zuma's conviction and sentence of more than 12 months in prison make him ineligible to stand for election in the National Assembly until five years have passed since the completion of his sentence. Zuma's 18-month conviction for contempt of court disqualifies him from serving in the National Assembly under South Africa's constitution. The Electoral Commission of South Africa, the IEC, had initially ruled Zuma ineligible. This decision was appealed and brought before the Constitutional Court, which upheld the IEC's ruling. Although Zuma's legal team urged that his reduced sentence and civil conviction should not disqualify him under Section 47 of the Constitution, but the court firmly disagreed. Despite the ruling, Zuma can still appear on campaign posters and ballots for the MK party, but he is barred from taking a seat in Parliament. He can still lead his party in other capacities. As the election approaches, this ruling marks a significant chapter in South Africa's legal and political landscape, reaffirming the rule of law and the constitutional provisions governing eligibility for public office. Stay informed, follow us on social media and subscribe to Daily Maverick YouTube channel for more news and in-depth analysis.